Well, I think the biggest thing from the standpoint uh, defensively, we obviously gave up a couple of big plays at inopportune times. Uh, but for the most part, we did the things we needed to do. We tackled. Uh, you know, our guys played hard, were aggressive. Uh, I thought we were physical. Uh, offensively, we just there were too many missed opportunities, particularly in the passing game. Uh, there was a, there was a combination of things. There were a number of times where I thought we had people open, and and Philip just didn't, didn't got hit as he's thrown. His arm got hit. He didn't have time. There were some times where I think because of the blitz that was being run or the rush uh, that he sp sped things up, uh, threw it quicker than he normally would, and it took away some opportunities. And and there were uh, I think a number of. Uh, different opportunities uh, that we had, uh, two or three of them on third down, which obviously the third downs throughout the game were critical, uh, but some of them uh, were ch chances at big plays and we just uh, uh, weren't able to protect or we, we were in such a hurry to get the ball out, we didn't make some of the plays that we are capable uh, of making. But you go through the tape and, and there's, there's great effort and there's guys uh, working hard. Uh, I mean, you can't give better effort than our two guards gave. Uh, uh, they have not played a lot. They've played. Uh, one of them played in his uh, started his second game, and, and one of them played in his second game ever as a Charger. And uh, one of them's been here two weeks, Tony and and Schilling. And and uh, you can't give better effort than they give. Uh, they they're outmatched some of the time. Well, there's. Uh, I think this team is is uh, working hard to. Uh, get some continuity and when you have as many changes you have as many new guys rolling in there and you're playing next to a new guy uh, one week and then it's another new guy the next week uh, you know trying to create some continuity uh, comfort level playing with those guys uh, you know there's two or three passes I think a couple of passes to Vincent Brown that Phillips expecting him to look look for the ball in the back shoulder. He's throwing the ball. He's running deep. Uh, there's some things like that. So, uh, you know, this this uh, our guys, uh, as I said, competed at a at a real high level. Uh, uh, there was it was a very physical game. Uh, you know, it was very similar to the game Denver had with the Jets. Uh, very physical game. It, it's not. It, it really isn't difficult for me. Uh, you know, I've been doing this uh, quite a while, and I, I know how to go about having a plan to get ready for a game. I get concerned at times that it affects people. Uh, it can affect some people around you, uh, so I work hard to make sure it doesn't. Uh, and as I said, I think our guys have done, a, done an outstanding job, coaches and players, of continuing to prepare uh, for each game. Uh, you know, obviously, uh, in, in the last uh, couple of games, we've given ourselves a chance to to be in a close game, giving ourselves a chance to win. We just haven't done it.